Hello and welcome back to Mass Effect, and we're getting right into a battle here. Uh, if you remember last time, we were going to find this guy, Harkin, as we were told to do by Anderson. He's our lead in terms of finding Garrus, who will help us out on the mission. At least uh, that's what Anderson and Udina think. All right, this guy, oh, we've already used all our stuff. Uh, I forgot that I actually went ahead and set my, uh, my hotkeys up, so I'm going to just... Throw him, there we go, all right. And let's finish him off. Very cool, all right. Caden got a little bit hurt, but that's all right, who cares, it's just Caden. All right, so here's Korazden. We don't know why we were fighting those guys just outside. They were obviously sent to stop us. And Korazden is, uh, eh, maybe it's a little bit seedy of a place. bothering you, General? I've seen a lot of horrible things in my days, and there's only one woman in this damn galaxy that helps me forget it. So if you feel that way, then why spread lies about her? Because she rejected me. Me! Septima Soraka, General of the Turian Fleet. Some general? What kind of example are you to your troops? The troops can kiss my leathery backside. All I wanted was to retire and be with her. Look, kid, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but don't waste your time. Ah, what are those fancy renegade options? Enemies see your weakness. You know that, General. Enemies? The one place I always felt at peace was with her. But now, <laughs> so you think it's that easy? Just straighten up and act like a general. I don't think it could hurt. Huh. Maybe you're right, Commander. Shaira's worth the effort. Even if she won't have me back. Now get up and get moving, General. All right. I'll go to her. After I've had a cold shower or two. Say, you're a bright kid. Would you be interested in earning a few extra credits? What do you want me to do? There's an Elcor diplomat out there. I believe Shaira gave up his secrets. Why does he think that? Now, if you're confused by what's going on, you must not have watched the last half episode. Uh, this is sort of an optional thing that uh, Shaira, the consort, wanted us to come see this general. Um, I'll just select this and I'll do this on the next half episode. But Shaira wanted us to come see this general because uh, he's, he's been spreading lies about her for some reason and we found out why, so no big deal. Shouting his secrets in public. Just gives us some experience points. It shows where I got my info. We'll exonerate Shaira and convince the Elcor. Who am I taking it to? And where is he? His name is Zeltan. He's an Elcor diplomat. He's over in the embassies complaining about Shaira. Well, here's the soldiers acting like soldiers. And in the last half, of the half episode, we found out who that Elcor was, so we can take it right to him on you the know, next half episode. You might Maybe not the next one. Maybe I'll just do that off camera. <laughs> All right. I imagine a general like that getting so upset about a woman. So let's head over here, and we found Harkin. Back off, Rex. Fizz told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fizz's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. All right. So back to Harkin. Hey, sweetheart, <laughs> for some fun. But I gotta say, that soldier get-up looks real good on that body of yours. Why don't you sit your sweet little ass down beside old Harkin? <laughs> Have a drink. See where this goes. I'd rather drink a cup of acid after chewing on a razor blade. You trying to hurt my feelings? You gotta do better than that. After 20 years with CSEC, I've been called every name in the book, Princess. Call me Princess again and you'll be picking your teeth up off the floor. Now tell me where Garrus is. Okay, okay, just relax. Garrus, you say? Hmm. You must be one of Anderson's crew. Poor bastard still trying to bring Saren down, huh? I know where Garrus is, but you gotta tell me something first. 
But the captain let you in on his big secret? Just tell me where Garrus is before this gets ugly. But it's all related, don't you see? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. I still heard he was going back there. I'm out of here. Yeah, good. Go. Let me drink it in peace. All right, so we found out where Garrus is, and luckily we know how to get back to the med clinic because we went there in the last half episode, so we're going to do that now. Tell us he used to be a specter. Maybe it's not true. Harkin's an ass. But he's just met. Oh, I guess I ran out of the uh, the zone before we could finish telling the story, but at least we got the subtitles. All right, so we're going to take the uh, rapid transit over to the med clinic. Here we go. Time to go find Garrus. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, Doc. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go. Ah! And just walks out of cover. Garrus, what are you doing? <laughs> All right. So let's uh, grab some cover ourselves. Oh, our powers are still charging. Oh, we can kind of hit him. There we go. One more over here in the corner, it looks like. All right, and problem solved. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you, all of you. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid, even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren, or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. Welcome aboard, Garrus. All right, so we're going to pick OK here just because we want to get all the crew members that we can get, even though I could pick the negative option to turn him down. Um, there's actually... There's an option that we have here. We could either go straight to Fist and take him out. What's he doing there? Or we can go to get Rex first, which Fist is what we're going to do. Um, the difference you is, if you don't get Rex first, if you hurry, um, you you're, you're going to end up sparing somebody that would have died if you picked up Rex. So we're just going to take the bitch option and make sure that uh, said person in question dies. I don't care about Ashley so much. We're going to bring Caden with us. All right. And we still have to upgrade uh, Garrus a little bit, but we're going to go ahead and get Rex, and then off camera, I'll go ahead and upgrade everybody. Let's head over to C Sec, because that is where. Uh, it's going to be the other direction, I think. No, this is the right way. That is where Rex is being held right at the moment. We just got to level up for some reason. I'm not sure. I guess we heard a conversation while we were running by. That's even better. We get more options. All right, and here's the uh, the fancy elevator down to CSEC.
Oh yes, you'll get Binary very used to these. Binary Helix settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan group had contracted Binary Helix to perform studies with a long-range goal of curing their genetic sterilization. The group later sued for a return of investment money when the study produced no viable results. Eventually we'll get there. As I stated in the last episode, these elevators are uh, for a predetermined amount of time. So no matter how powerful your system is, it's just going to take a certain amount of time to get to the top. Unfortunately, that's how it's programmed. The other games are programmed much better, and the loading times didn't take nearly as long. So here's the fancy CSEC portion of the Citadel. Sorry, I didn't mean to get inside your conversation there. Uh, and Rex is being held right over here for some reason. Let's go figure out what's going on. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? I'm going after Fist. I don't want you getting in my way. Huh. Now I recognize you. Commander Shepard from the Alliance. Heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. I think we're gonna get along just fine, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. All right, now we have all the crew members we need. We're going to bring the two new ones along and get them all upgraded fully. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave me a comment down below on which Steam game you think that I should be playing next. I'll leave a link to all of my Steam games in the description down below. You guys have a good one.